The C. Allen Morning Show presents Bennett and Brown. Sit back and be beautiful. <laughs> All right, everybody. Yes, indeed. Alonzo, you got that music pumping this morning. All right, everybody. Good morning. It's the C. Allen Morning Show. I tell you, this is yours truly, Sea Island, and we have Seven here. Good morning, Seven. Good morning, everyone. I tell you, listen, we have, uh, today we're talking about the business of beauty. So what we want you to do is if you have a stylist, if you have a barber, if you have someone, anyone that owns a beauty in the, uh, uh, <laughs> a beauty business. Come on now, get it, it together. Yeah, you need to have them to call us. You need to have them to call us. Anyone who owns a beauty business, today we're going to be helping you help to create that business for yourself for the new year. All right. So for those who are just tuning in, this is the Sea Island Morning Show. This this is Beauty Talk Radio. We're here to talk about beauty, fashion, fashion, entertainment, beauty, entertainment, education. This is where you can call us. Seven is the international skin expert. And then I am Chet C. Allen Bennett, the owner of the Bennett Career Institute and all of the C. Allen salons and spas. So we come on every Monday to uh, kind of talk to our uh, our folks in the beauty industry and talk to all of our clients in reference to... Uh, and regular people, too. Yeah, talk to all of our clients and talk to all of our listeners uh, to kind of help them with all of their uh, regimens and things of that nature. On January the 8th, you know, uh, you need to go to the Morning Show website, C-A-L-A-N, morningshow.com. Seven is doing the seven steps to great skin and anti-aging. And one of the things that um, I haven't touched on was I haven't touched on the anti-aging part. We thought it was important that seven did that because a lot of our a lot of my listeners you know uh we have that young group but we also have that dedicated that dedicated season group of listeners and they want to know how to protect their skin you know we have a lot of 60 and 70 year olds and we're happy to have you to be a part of the morning show so we created a workshop where we can teach you the seven great uh steps to uh great skin skin, yes and anti-aging Yes, it's kind of like the Benjamin Button effect that people are expecting. And that's not really what anti-aging is. It's being comfortable in the skin that you're in and doing the best that you can to keep it healthy and great until, you know, well into your last days. Okay, very good. Now, also, if you go to the website, C-A-L-A-N Morning Show, Dot com. You need to make sure that you like the page because all day today we're going to be calling out some of our friends on Facebook that we're going to be giving them uh, my 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 favorite product, the product of the month. <laughs> Of course, it's my oatmeal almond soap, and I was so excited because we so we sell out of that soap seven every time I bring it out of the kitchen. Every time I make the soap, the soap is all gone. So. I made a big batch over the weekend, and we're going to be giving out uh, so seven at any time. And you time. know what, though? This is a, a great season to be using oatmeal and almond soap, too. That oil is great for skin. So I've actually fallen in love with it myself. I hate to admit it, C. Allen. Okay, very good. And now if you're not local, and we call your name, if you're not local, make sure that you... Uh, uh, give us a call into the office because our first uh, Sea Island person that we're going to give is, I can't pronounce the name. Spe- Lord, maybe you should spell it. It's D space L-Y-F-E-T-T-F-E-E-T-E-R-N-A-L Saint. So I don't Lufetanol know. Saint, it looks like. D Lufetanol, Lifetanol Saint. Or oh, Life Eternal Saint. I oh think that's goodness. what it is. D- <laughs> We messed that up. Okay, D Life Eternal Saint. If you're listening here, which I'm sure you are on the Sea Island Morning Show, you have an opportunity to um, come in and pick up your oatmeal almond soap. Okay, now let's move forward. Now today, go ahead, Seven. Well, it's about time to get our breakfast, isn't it? Oh yeah. Yeah, we got to get our breakfast with Celebrity Chef Wendell. Okay, and and I have a question for the chef. Chef, good morning. Good morning. How are you guys doing this morning? I'm fine. So listen, Great, Chef. Sir. Before you get started, let me. Want, add. But, but before you get started, okay. I want some um, rosemary, uh, hemp, and some kind of soap. <laughs> <laughs> okay. You putting your order in? <laughs> right, I put my order in. 
Okay, Chef, we'll take care of that. So let's... <laughs> With hints of mango. Well, we have to be clear. Hemp oh, no. doesn't mean the fraudulent right. hemp. Right, right, right. It's, it's okay. the good hemp. Okay, and then, and, then all, and also, Chef, I do have a mango soap that really sells very, very well. So, um, oh, really? I, I didn't, I didn't, wow, I didn't know all this. I like that. Uh-huh. I, like I, I, think, I think today is the day that um, one of our executive producers, Linda West Point, which we love dearly, she's going to be sending those gifts out to everybody. So you will get something this week. But listen, we, we, we have a busy day. We're talking about the business of beauty. But let me ask you this, Chef. Today I started in support of uh, one of my co-workers she's uh she's doing a liquid diet a doctor says she has to do a liquid diet for two weeks so i'm going to go ahead in support of her do the liquid diet it started today so give me your tips really quickly and you can go into your session give me your tips on what do you think i need to do in order to maintain these two weeks so i won't have to be falling out on the side of the road talk to me <laughs> so you're going you're going straight liquid Yes, for two weeks, and they said what? What they also said to for me to eat like Jello pudding and Jello stuff like that, sugar free. Right. No. Well, that's backwards. Let me tell you what. And I hate to contradict someone that gave you some really. No, good that's things. fine. That's why we're talking to the tell us. right? Because I mean, they're putting gelatin in your body, and that's great to build up your electrolytes. That's why you got to eat the gelatin uh, or Jello because electrolytes. That's what they give you in the hospital. Mm -hmm. It's great for a hangover. But, you know, really to go liquid, I would go, you know, greens, kale, um, all the green products and blend them up and you can put some agave in it. And so if you're going straight liquid, I would go liquid like that to have some substance with it. So because you, your body will go into shock if you're going straight liquid. I mean, you really will go into shock. You will pass out and uh, you won't. And we can't have and, that. Yeah, exactly. So anybody that directs you, you have to walk into that. You can't just. All of a sudden, it's like stop smoking. You're going to freak mm -hmm. out. you got to walk yourself into that. So I would go into, and the median of it is to have uh, shakes and blends and fruit fruit blends. And also, if you're trying to lose weight, the fruit blends, you don't want to eat after 7 o'clock because it doesn't digest. Mm -hmm. You want to eat all fruit before 7 o'clock. Because what but she said, Chef, was I need to get protein shakes and okay. water and crystal light and jello and jello pudding. But crystal light is poor. I mean, if you read mm. it, it's not, that's not good to do crystal light. So you can do other natural juices. But remember, eating any fruit product after 7 o'clock, fruit is the, hard, is the hardest one to digest in the, in the family group after 7 o'clock. But I hope that helped you out. Yeah, it did. And the only other thing is I can't find, spell that stevia. Spell that for me. S-T-E-A-V-I-A. S-T-E-A-V-I-A. Stevia. And they have it in different flavors. They have it in raspberry. They have it in orange. I can't they find it. it. Uh, you have to go to Whole Foods. Okay. All right. Well, go ahead, Chef. Go go Give ahead. us our breakfast, Chef. Okay, Forget we, about we, him. This is not his personal is, consultation. Did you turn your mic down, oh, Jesus. Right. Go ahead, yeah, Chef. The seven's about to but get by in By the way, I want, to, I want to say to everybody, happy holidays. Oh. But watch this. Um, I think the best food, I know the best food in the entire world is family love. And the one thing that we're missing right now with the whole holidays and life and the whole thing is that food for the soul. And the food for the soul is sitting down with your family and eating. And if there's a budget constraint, fine. Bring all the McDonald's bags to the table. And I think everybody needs to sit down and eat and enjoy their food together. Some wholesome love. Where is that word called Mama, Mimi, Grandma, Mama Lee? Where is that? We haven't called upon that in a long time. And I think the kids grabbing the food from the kitchen and going to their room and closing the door. I think the spiritual love and the food and the wholesomeness is a great thing that we need to bring back together and bring family back together. And where is the love? I'm serious. So I think eating is one thing. Healthy is one thing. But finding out what's going on with your kids, with education and all those values and finding out what's going on with mama, what's going on with husband. What's going on with everybody? And I think sitting down at the table, be it morning, noon, and night, I think you got to get that in throughout the week. And that is my topic, ChefWendellPrice.com. Thank you. Thank All you, right. Chef. Thank you so much, Chef. Have a Merry Christmas. I Chef. want my almond soap. Yeah, you're going <laughs> to you're gonna start with the mango, so we're going to send that out today. All right. Thanks, you guys. All right. Thanks, Chef. Well, Seven, I just think that that's really ironic that Chef Wendell um, talked about food for the soul, dealing with the family, because what I just said to my mother, and my mother's listening now, Joyce Bennett, I said to her, I said, this year, 
I'm not going to do what I normally do. In the past, I open up my doors Christmas evening. I go with my family in the morning. Then in the evening, I have all of the friends that um, are away from home that migrated to the district that do not have family here. I have all of them over uh, for Christmas evening because, you know, you know to, think, to think that they would be by themselves. But you know what I said this year? I said this year, I always end up running out of the house. You know, when uh, some other siblings come with their children because they come later. And I always end up running out of the house. I said, this year, I'm going to stay at my mother's house the entire day. I'm going to go over there after church. I'm going to stay until at night, bring my Chauncey and Chelsea, bring my babies with me, and just stay there. Mm -hmm. And just stay there. So I'm going to stay there. Uh, And this way. You know, uh, like 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 the chef said, food for the soul. I'm going to stay and enjoy my family. So, what are you? So, what are you going to do for Christmas? Well, I think I'm going to spend Christmas very similar to you guys. You know, I I think this year has been you know a pretty long one and and rough for many people. So, it's time for family to come back together and sit down and have a meal together, whatever that meal is. I agree. So, I'm going to do soul food myself. Okay, very good. All right, everybody. Today uh, we have um, the topic is the business of beauty. If you have questions now, we have the cosmetic executive on the line. Seven's going to introduce her. We're going to go to the break. And then after the break, you'll hear from our guests. And if you have any questions, make sure you call us so we can talk about the business of beauty. Seven, who do we have this morning? We have T. Bernie. Oh, this is a special favorite for me because... She is one of those people that you never forget. She's a cosmetic executive, public speaker, a cultural marketing expert. She has a master's of studies in cosmetics and fragrant marketing from FIT. She's done brand management, work for American Express, Citigroup, Estee Lauder. And, you know, most people probably are familiar with her as the Bernie from Coco Chic, which is a very sexy name. CocoChic.com is one of the leading sites online where you can get ethnic beauty content. So I'm definitely looking forward to talking to her about beauty. All right, everybody. 1-800-450-7876. This is Bennett and Brown live on the Sea Island Morning Show. We'll be right back after these messages.